I've always been really big on keeping my horses framed and using my left rein. Whether I'm heading or heeling, I would always want to make sure I had control with my left hand because so many of us get caught up in roping and these horses are creatures of habit. And then they just get to doing things. A heel horse wants to cut in, a head horse wants to duck. So I'll spend a lot of time using my bridle, using my feet to make sure I have control. Now, for every action, there's a reaction. And I've been in a habit here lately, just being honest about my mistakes, of overriding and overdoing that. And Trevor and I were just talking about it. I was talking about it yesterday with Wesley Thorpe that I haven't been allowing my horses to work enough on their own. It's really important to have control in the turn so that you can you know, manage what's going on when the steer's in front of you. If you see, see something maybe the horse wouldn't react to early enough, pick up if a steer falls or stumbles or starts to check off. But once you've got that control, you have to let go of their, the mouth. You have to push and let go of the bridle because if you're getting your rate off of the bridle, then we're doing it wrong. You have to have rate as a healer, as a header off of your rope and off of your feet by driving and having that timing where if you're doing it off of the bridle reins, it's a slow fade into a horse that wants to run off. A lot of you headers out there, your horses probably get really strong going to the steer. You get to pulling, you get to pulling match and before long, all you're doing is pulling your tips up healers the same way. We get to pull in through the turn and before long our tip's up and we can't catch and our horses are strong and free. Sometimes it's the exact opposite what we need to be doing. We have to trust them and it may take a few runs or a few practices to get that trust back to where we can drive using our feet, using our rope, and then they'll start to do what they were born and bred to do, which is cow and stay back and, and listen to what we're doing. Use your bridle, use your horsemanship, but at the same time, let your horses do what you've trained them to do. Once the turn starts as a healer, let trust your horse and let him lock onto the cow so that you're using your feet and that helps with your timing, helps with your loop, header, exact same thing.